What? Oh my goodness. The audacity. Hello. Alright guys, it's been a while. It's been a- oh my. Girl, did you- It's been a long time coming since I've done an actual YouTube video with a camera. This camera is not the best quality, nor is it something I'm going to complain about because it still works. Okay. Anyways. Okay, so y'all read the title, What's in My Bag 2024. Alright. Moment of truth. This is my current bag, purse, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Yeah. I have a lot of bags. Usually I switch them out at least once every 20 days minimum. 22 max. I'll have a bag, the same bag for 22 days max because I'm 22. For some reason I work with numbers. So yeah, this is my current bag. It's basically a tote bag with chamomile. Dude, I know that's I said that wrong, but I'm not gonna really give a fuck right now. It has some words. I've never read it. Um, I don't really care to read it. It's a it's a tote bag. It's a bigger bag. Um, when I want to carry more stuff. Also, don't mind that I'm wearing like this sweater. It's it's like 90 degrees today, I think. And as I said before, my entire closet is long sleeves, sweaters, jackets. This is why I wasn't prepared this summer or spring. I was not prepared. Yeah, today's a high of 95. So, first thing in this bag. So this bag is just an open pocket, and then we have like a mini pocket, which yeah, I just have a mini pocket. Also, I didn't clean this bag out, so we're I'm we're looking at it together. Because I don't necessarily remember what's in it and what's not. Well, there's some things I know that's in it, obviously. Should we start with a small pocket or the big pocket? I think we're going to start with a small pocket. So a small pocket. First things first, we have this line sticker. I found this in my boyfriend's car. Also, this video, I want it to be short, but I know it's not. So I apologize beforehand okay so i got this lion sticker um i found this in my boyfriend's car and i was like yo that's cute can i have it and he said yeah like because apparently he went to a boba shop and then they said that he can get a free sticker he didn't want one and then he had to get one so he got this so it's mine now then in the small pocket i have some like little jewelry i don't know what i just dropped in my own hand but yeah i have some jewelry loose jewelry this is like the jewelry i wear on a daily if i go out i don't normally go up so first i have this like mood ring it's just a mood ring. And then I have this ring that I hauled before. Ugh. That ring. And then I have just a simple, like, band ring that I wear to pretend that I'm married. Which I am. My boyfriend would hurry the fuck up. And then I have these earrings. These are from Target. That I also hauled. They're, like, really shit now. They're not really, like, they're, like, kind of deteriorate. They're just, like, little gold hoops. Basically, I don't know if it's focused. If it's not, I don't give a shit. I don't think you give a shit either. And then I have one, one just random gold hoop <laughs> that I don't know where the other one went. Then I have my current raid that I've been trying to get to is um <sighs> ferocious sharks. Let's not talk about it, okay? I'm trying to work from the bottom up, okay? I haven't read in a long time. I'm trying to get back into books, but I gotta start somewhere. Bro, my attention span is, like, worse than a goldfish, I swear. So I'm trying my best, okay? It's not even about the vocabulary or, like, reading in it itself. I cannot pay attention, and that's literally why I'm reading kid books right now. So shut the fuck up and mind your business. Anyways, next, I got Tomat Sudoku book. Does that have my name? Oh, it's a Suck Me Bum. For some reason. I think I've had this for so long. I'm stuck on level 8. Or no, level or question 8. Because recently I had jury duty. I don't know when. It was like a while back. I had jury duty and like, bruh, like, you, you be waiting for so long. So now I take this everywhere in case that ever happens again. Like a situation like that ever happens again. So, yeah. Next we have these big band-aids. Because I went to the horse races with my boyfriend. Um, my boyfriend has a situation where he just, if he has like a little scab or whatever and you pick it, or if it gets picked, whatever the fuck, he just bleeds, bleeds, bleeds. And I took him to the infirmary at the racetrack and then they were just laughing. And then they gave me these, well, she snuck me some band-aids because there was a guy and a girl and the guy was like taking it so serious and the girl was just laughing because it's like not a serious thing whatsoever. Like it was, a, it was like a scab, like, like it was like the size, the thumbtack needle. That's how big the size was, but it just wouldn't stop bleeding. So she gave me these big ass band-aids. So I keep this for my boyfriend specifically. And I got some receipts. Yeah. Actually, no, let's read. I went to, I think this is Taco Bell. Yeah, Taco Bell, Walgreens, Target. 
uh, Thundling. We got Mickey D's. Okay. And then Walgreens. Slay. I recently got that app where you make money off receipts. And it doesn't fucking work because I don't go shopping that often. Anyways, then I got some wet wipes. My boyfriend's mom gave me these when I went to Switzerland with my boyfriend. I, I don't need them for the most part, but I have them. I've used quite a bit. Well, usually people ask for them, so I keep them in here for other people. Next, we got... Oh, wait. It's upside down. My bad. My cold sore patches. If you don't know what this is, I'll show you. Oh, my God. I always fuck up. So, anyways, it's just like these. I've used four, I think. But I get cold sores kind of often now. I usually get them because if it's super hot and I'm in the sun, if I get sick, or if I'm super stressed. So recently I just got one. It's it's done now. But the scar is kind of still left. That's why I have a lot of scars on the bottom of my lip because I always get cold sores. I get cold sores because I was at once at a choir. I used to be in choir. Don't talk about it. No, but I'm a chapstick bitch. I need chapstick all the time. I hate having chap lips. That pisses me off more than anything in this life. So I forgot my chapstick at home. I asked a girl, I, I kept asking everyone, like, do you have chapstick? Do you have chapstick? Everyone said no, understandably. And then this one girl, she's like, oh, I got lip gloss. It's the same thing. I was like, slay, give it to me. And then the next day I got a bump on my lip and I was like, what the fuck is this? And then that night I got a cold sore and cold sore is basically like oral herpes. So I have herpes. You know me. I want to die. Anyways, next. Next we have my wallet. I used to have my big boy um, dude wallet, but my boyfriend was like, stop well this because my boyfriend bought me a coach purse and so i use the wallet because the coach purse looks too fancy for my style my style is very homeless so i use the wallet because it's just really like flat and thin i'm not a fan of these kind of wallets but i want to be a fan of it because i just my wallets always look like it's meant for a guy and i'm trying to be a girl right now oh i have money in here oh. look we got 50 frank y'all want to see how i look bro Y'all wanna see? I look like a drug dealer. Do I not look like a drug dealer? And then I have just like my car insurance and then I have three credit cards and then- Oh no, I have two- th Yeah, three credit cards and then one debit card. Slay. Like, Alright. And don't try to steal my cards. I have nothing on them. I'm negative. I'm in the negatives, okay? God. Anyways, next. We have these cough drops. These are from Switzerland. These are- Y'all, if I could go to Switzerland just to buy these, I would. These are like the most amazing cough drops. They taste like candy. It's so good. I try my best not to eat these because they're just so good. And like, I can't, I'm not going to go back for a long fucking time, obviously, because it's expensive. But yeah, you can only buy them in Switzerland. You can't, you can't ship them, which is so stupid. But these are so fucking good. And my stupid boyfriend, once he likes something, he keeps fucking eating it. So he kept snacking on these and he was taking my shit. This is my limited edition crap. We have an outlet. We have my little wire. Every car I drive does not support the new Apple. Because my phone, I have a 15. And the 15, the port is different. The port looks like this. Like, this is the port. Okay, so I bought this adapter. And I use this for every car or any time I need to charge my phone. Because no one supports my, my shit. So it literally looks like this. It's the dumbest car. Once this phone is done, this, like, dead can't fucking use it. I'm switching to Android. I don't give a flying fuck. I'm so tired of Apple being like a little money hungry little bitch. Sorry. I shouldn't get like that violent with this like cute little green sweater on. Okay, next. I just have a claw slip. This like big bitch. I got the big girls because I got a lot. I have really long hair, but my hair's been thinning out. So it's not that thick anymore. But I have long hair, so I need the biggie one. Okay, the next then I have a vial of hair. We're not going to get into that because I'll cry. So, anyways... Next we got my little star face. Also, I highly recommend this because it is cruelty free. And it is the cutest thing in the world. Oh my god, I don't want to show you guys the mirror. But there's a mirror and it comes with the pimple patches. I don't think that gets rid of your acne. But it's a cute way to hide your acne. I only wear it when I have pimples that like fucking hurt. Like right now, I have literally one that just is a little bitch. And I try to kill it, but it wouldn't go away. So, I put a little star. Gold star for trying. Next, we have this little baggie of... I think it has $10 and then lentils. I celebrated New York New Year's with my boyfriend's family. His family in general is very into... I don't know. I, my family doesn't celebrate tradition, tradition, so I don't really know any traditions. But once the new year, you throw the lentils up and then you collect the lentils. And then it's good luck to keep it in your bag for the whole year. So I've been keeping it in my bag because I need the luck. 
I need it. I got four pens. I love these pens. So first pen, I got my cinnamon roll pen. My friend Samantha got this one for me. It's so cute. It's dirty now, but this is such a good pen because it's sharp. Like I could stab a bitch with this. And then I got my little dinosaur pen. It is so cute. This I got for a dollar and it has like different colors. The dinosaur just pops off, but sometimes he doesn't. But it has a different colors and stuff and it's like really useful if you're a colorful bitch. And then I have this one. This is a Japanese one I got at Tokyo Central and it erases. It's a pen, but you can erase the, the, the ink. So it's great. And then I have this pen that I got from Japan. I didn't go to Japan recently, but I had my brother go to Japan and he brought me back a pen because I asked for pens. So this, I'm pretty sure if I'm wrong, let me know, but also don't because ugh, I didn't ask. Um, but anyways, I did, but just pretend I didn't. I'm pretty sure these are like, if you ever watch Spirited Away, I'm pretty sure these are like the sprinkles that he throws at the little soot. Next, I got an old, old hand sanitizer from Bath & Body Works. Also, I don't recommend Bath & Body Works because it's not cruelty-free, but I have a ton of Bath & Body Works. I used to collect it a long time ago when I was 12, and I still have them, so I've been trying to use it up and crap. I got this little hand sanitizer. This smells like pears, and it's really good, but I don't really, like, use hand sanitizer because I don't really go out. But yeah, it's old as balls. It's old as time. I think this is, like, 10 years old at least, but it works. The next thing I have is this. I don't know where I went. I got this from. I know someone gave it to me. I did not buy this. This is a hand butter from where? This is also from Bath & Body Works. Uh, this is, I think, just a hand lotion. This is in fucking... Girl, I don't fucking know. It's a hand lotion. God damn. So I keep this in because I sometimes have dry hands, which I don't, but sometimes I do. I have my little Sony Angel. He's a little naked baby. I have the panda one. I didn't want the panda one, but that's what I got. And I only need one. I don't need more, okay? I collect a lot, but this naked baby is like the ugliest naked baby ever. But I like him because he's my little buddy, so I keep him. His head comes off. I love it. He's naked. He got booty and stuff. He's just my traveling buddy. He's not my favorite. I didn't want him. I could have gotten another one, and I preferred another one. But this is what I got, and I don't need another. Maybe I will. Maybe one for each bag, but not right now. A bitch is poor. Anyways, next. Um... <laughs> Dude, I got like medical conditions or some shit. I got my canker sore reliever because I get canker sores a lot. Um, you just put it in your mouth. I have two in my mouth right now. Dude, I don't know what's wrong with me. Like, I don't, like, this mouth is infected all the time. I swear to God. It's because, like, I think it's because I yap too much and then I let the germs in or some shit. I don't know. But I have it in case. So sometimes they're fucking, they hurt like a bitch, bitch. Anyways, next. So I got this magnet that I put in the back of my phone and I have it on the dashboard of usually any car I drive because I need directions. My memory is dog shit and I will never remember where to go. So I need dagger. I need directions and I need my phone like right there. Last item, I got this compact mirror that says my name on it. My mother got this for me for Christmas a long time ago. But I don't really use it because I'm not doing anything that I need a mirror for, but it works. Get blinded! Get blinded! Sorry. It won't happen again. And then I got straws. Because I go to Taco Bell a lot. That was my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this video is shorter. That was my intention. I don't think it will be actually now that I think about it. But I hope it is. Because I know that my attention span is not the greatest. So I don't assume yours is either. Hope you guys like, comment, subscribe if you feel if you need to. If you don't, that's fine. I don't really give a shit. Don't follow me on my socials. Um, I deleted that shit off my phone because it's not good for me. I actually have my boyfriend monitoring, monitoring my socials because I shouldn't be on it. And I've been trying to work more on my brain. Okay? Anyways. Also comment what kind of videos you guys want to see because I don't know. My audience is very sparse or no, very, there's a lot of variety with my audience. I don't know what's going on. I thought people, the people who were watching me were little kids. I'm wrong. The majority of y'all are th in your 30s, which is fine. There's no issue there. Okay. It's all good. I'm not 30, but it's fine if you're 30. But like, what do y'all want to see? Because I, I'm not doing anything with substance. So if you want to see something with sub substance, I can show you something. Anyways, hope you guys have a great day.